All right, so Chunk and I just went downstairs to get something because as you can see, I took my braids out, right? And so I needed something to hold me over. And I hate wigs because they look stupid, they look wiggish on me sometimes, right? But I'm still searching for something to hold my head in between the time I get to do it again because I'm about to start Pilates. And let me tell you something, I don't care how cute the twist outs look. Listen, I have hair, y'all see I have hair. Yeah. But no matter how how cute or how interesting these twist, or, twist outs look, after exercising and, and doing some shit, you know, you need to do your hair over. So I ordered this cheap wig and um, cheap. nothing fancy, it's not lace. It's got combs on the inside, on the sides and adjustable strap in the back, right? So I'm going to see how this fits on my head and I'm gonna shape it and see what the hell it looked like after the fact, I'll be back. Okay, before I put it on my head, I just want y'all to see the shape of it. So this is the shape. So you can automatically tell I'm gonna have to cut some of the bangs and reshape the sides. But we're gonna see what this looks like, all right? But the curls are really nice, all right? Curls are really nice. I need some shit to show up on Coffee with Friends, y'all. So if y'all know of alternative things I could slap on my head, wigs or whatever the case may be, let a sister know, because I need to be to wake up in the morning and be able to slap something on in the meantime. I'm not a big wig wearer, but I, I'm gonna try this thing because I'm not gonna be able to keep up with my hair. So be back. Okay, it's been a while since I've had this much hair on my face, but y'all know I like big hair. So this, I don't know. I'm trying to see if y'all can see. You know, it's very, I mean, it doesn't give you a natural part up top or anything like that. Listen, it's a cheap wig. But this is what it looks like when I first put it on my face. Not that bad, huh? Look, and I'm sure you could tuck it behind your ears. You could pin it up somehow, do different things with it. But I'm gonna trim it and try to frame the face a little bit and see how this looks. But not so bad, right y'all? Not so bad. Let's see what I could do with the trim. Okay, so this is what I got. Some a little cheap ass wig, you know, to hold me over until I get my hair done again because a sister's gonna need some love. So what y'all think? What y'all think? Thumbs up. This is the back. And now you can see it has movement, right? I took a little pin and I pinned it behind my ear but it has movement and it's cute y'all. This is a $22 wig. This is what I'm talking about. I know a lot of guys don't like wigs, but do women go around telling guys what the fuck to do with their heads and their faces and shit like that? And I know no guys are gonna come for me on this post talking about they like a natural woman. This is a natural ass wig, okay? And we like natural men too, but we ain't sneezing at y'all for spraying shoe polish on your heads and getting man weaves. Let us live, all right? So just tell me what you think. <laughs> and with that, I'm out.